is the energy vibration reading for the scorpions hello my darlings scorpion sun moon and rising if this is your first time please like and share I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back let's see what is happening for you scorpions this is the week of the 15th the week goes from the 9th until the 15th and I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful supports okay on Monday for the we have justice justice has been coming up for a lot of you water sign a lot so um, for the people who have, have been having conflicting situation um, legal matters and that sort of a thing it's going to be good good news is going to come in on Monday on Tuesday we have the energies of the lovers so if there was an injustice um, for some people you're going to be divorcing and the divorce is going to come through on Monday on Tuesday some of you will be meeting someone very special and this person is going to you're going to end up marrying this person whoever you have met or you're about to meet on Tuesday you're going to end up marrying them and this person is going to bring you stability in your life this could be if your mom is a um, a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn this is also a very very positive situation that is going to come in on Wednesday with you and your mom on Thursday there is a Queen of Wands okay um, this Queen of Wands could be someone who you know it could be a haunt or it could be someone who has played a role in your life but you have a situation we're going to look at that on Friday um, we have the energy of the magician and your own energy so this is good because the king of cups so you guys are in your reading and this is the knight of cups so whoever you are and you are um, between the ages of 18 and 45 it's a positive positive situation if you have a legal situation you're going to win this if you have a, a, an, an injustice you're divorcing um, or you have a separation with your um, partner this is going to be good because you're going to be winning whatever is transpiring then we have uh, the page the page of swords the page of swords is information is you communicating clearly and this could be that you're communicating clearly to your mother about your relationship or whatever as transpiring in your relationship but whatever you're saying is coming out very good because it's going to have an impact on who you're saying in this to the page of the page of cups is coming out so you could be saying you know I love you mom I'm sorry for whatever happened or this you are dealing because you're dealing with two women and one of them or either a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and another one is an um, Aries Leo or Sagittarius okay whoever these two women are um, there is a strong positive love that is coming in and they're like a motherly figure to you so it could be a man uh, who is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn for some people or it could be a woman who is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn some of you are going to be connecting but I'm seeing a more of a mother figure for this earth sign person so um, it could be that you uh, you know you are trying to balance out a um, your maternity feelings or your feelings about these two women but there is the feelings of you connecting with your mom so if um, and money what what is happening money is going to be coming at you it's as if um, I'm, I'm getting it that your financial situation is good but whatever this legal matter is whatever that comes out because you have you have used your intellect uh, to, 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 to get out of whatever problem you were in. You have used your intellect, and this is good. So let's see what is happening in the first half of the week for you. There is a situation between you and the lovers. There is something that has happened, and you are now balancing this out. And you have a strong foundation against 
whoever this person was so if you are leaving a relationship or there was a legal suit or there was a lawsuit or you there was a divorce or something you're going to receive an, in the house okay let's say that you um was married and whatever the situation is you are going to receive the house okay because I'm seeing this justice that is taking place and you are going to receive the house the house is going to be yours because whatever that has transpired the universe make sure because the energy of the Empress is saying not to worry about this because this is going to be okay so whatever is your situation after your divorce you're going to receive this house and this is going to be good the knight of swords is coming at you this is someone who is um, between the ages of 18 and 30 whoever this person is we're going to see what is his problem it has to do with the lovers it has to do with a soulmate relationship so again um, you scorpions are coming up um, with this love situation because um, I think you guys are the third sign to receive uh, um, that you're going to be connecting with your soulmate or your twin flame which is very very good um, you have a strong foundation um, this person is um, whoever you're dealing with was your twin flame or your soulmate okay but it's as if there is this person that is coming in that is you know and it could be that you have been having a relationship um, with someone who is a, um, a, a an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra it is your soulmate but be aware of this okay because there's going to be a lot of conflicts I don't think that that is the right person for you but um, you know you have to listen to your intuition because maybe their car karmatic situation that should um, be um, dealt with then you are going to be balancing out your financial situation and this is why um, you know the energy of the Empress comes up to say not to worry about your financial situation if you have a financial situation between you and your mom and your mom is an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius um, this financial situation is going to be balanced out okay let's see what else is happening because love you the Queen of Pentacles is going to help you the Queen of Pentacles is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person is going to help you and you are going to really really appreciate this person so you know whoever this you are and your mom is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn she loves you deeply there's no question it, nothing that you do will change the love that she has for you okay nothing that you do will change the love that she has for you but the thing that you should understand is that she will love you but she doesn't have to love your partner because this this is our these earth sign people are they love their kids but it doesn't say that they have to love their kids partner okay so if you decided that you know you're going to go with someone who your mother is not really um, happy with it's your life but don't expect her don't expect your mom to give her open arms to this person because your mom will never do that okay next energy is that you're seeing a situation clearly um, and this this whatever is going on you need to understand that you have to live your own life um, your parents already lived their own life but what is happening is that um, you know it's your life but don't expect them to accept the people that you um, uh, accepting your life because your parents are always seen uh, whenever a relationship is not healthy and sometimes you are not seeing this that the relationship is not healthy but your parents are seeing that it's not a healthy relationship and um, it is a balance that you have to make between um, yourself and your 
parents you have to understand that you know if even my mom is not approving of this relationship and I feel like this is the relationship for me go ahead with the relationship but do not expect do not bring this person over at your parents house and expect that your parents are going to open up you know to them because no that's something that they're not going to do especially if you know you're dealing with an earth sign mom they are like I don't think you're right for my kid I am not opening up myself so don't expect that this is going to be a happy um, you know gathering when this person because you know whoever this person is if they have done something unjust to you or something unjust to your parents don't expect your mom to open up to someone so you know what is happening is that you know your mom will give you the blessing not your partner your mom will give you the blessings but your mom is not going to give your partner the blessing because your mom knows that it's not a healthy relationship and this is the situation that is happening you have to understand that earth sign people can see these air sign people um, much better than how they you as a water sign seeing them because water and hair doesn't go but you or um, you're in a vase in this relationship now so don't expect that your family will accept this person it's their uh, it's your life but um, you know it's time to really meditate on this okay so for the people who are having situation where your your parents are not accepting your relationship it is your relationship don't ex expect your parents to accept it because there's a reason why they are seeing that the relationship is not healthy for you and um, this is what happened when um, things like these happen so you know celebrate and honor your physical body through dance and movement because this is going to help you to awaken um, your you know your spiritual light and this is going to be good listen to your intuition about the situation because whatever is happening um, your angels and guides are saying listen to your intuition okay listen to your intuition because this is going to help you to move you forward I want to say namaste until next time